cold rainy day here in Norwich and I am still on a bit of a mission <laughs> before I can get the vlog and the dead horse channel up where it needs to be now today is Tuesday and this vlog will be on the Sean King channel on this day Tuesday now I did make a vlog Sunday at the car boot and that vlog should have gone up on the vlog and the dead horse channel on Sunday but it had uh, restrictions put on it like all my vlogs do and it's now took until it's still under review um, so I apologize for, for that it's YouTube holding up the dead horse channel um, I will make a quick vlog for that uh, just to point people that I'm, I'm gonna be making vlogs on this channel and um, I'm loading up vlogs on the I'm going in channel the the bike cam and all my other channels just so I can keep a bit of entertainment your way and so now anyway I've got I've, I've got the scooter started right <laughs> that's all well and good and um, when I worked on the scooter to start with I was a little bit surprised that I'd actually emptied the fuel tank I don't often do stuff like that I'd actually done the right thing so that was pretty good so when I got it all running with new fuel and the carb all cleaned and everything that was all brilliant but something I forgot to do I also emptied the gearbox so there's no gearbox oil so even though the, the vehicle is running <laughs> it's running a bit hot <laughs> so I have come into the city once again in the truck I, I don't really like driving the truck no I don't I like a nice little scooter Just scooting about them Oh man, the radio's on. Oh man, don't don't do that. Turn the turn that hang on. Turn that back on and put the window up. All this, don't get this on a scooter. Just pull up and turn off. <laughs> right, so I'm going in to oh man. Motorcycle MOT's repair centre. It used to be Danny D's. It's the only place I know where I can get some two-stroke oh, gearbox oil. So I can get on the horse. Ah, that's what I need. So, keys, keys, keys. So many of them. Let's see if he's actually in. I'm going in here. He, he mainly does MOTs. That's where he makes most of his money. I'm hoping he's here. I used to have my bike MOT there before it came MOT exempt. Oh man. Looks ominous. Little entrance. Good, eh? Yeah. Is he in there? He is in there. All right. You alright? That's pointing at me. That's, that's alright then. That's alright then. What is it with people in Norwich? They don't like being on film. But it's alright. If you ever want an MOT or any motorbike spears it, or oils, you need to come. It's still called Danny D's, yeah, right? It's still called Danny D's, right? Oh, wicked. And uh, what is it? ST90 I need for my gearbox oil? Yeah, mate, yeah. Good man. How'd you get on? Yeah, really good. I'm um, good. I'm good. I did see. I watched a few. Of watched one or two. Yeah, hey, that's two. awesome. That's what, mate. That's changed my life by being able to get in front of a camera and not give a. F it is. It's good. good All right, God. Be back with me a minute. I have got my gearbox oil. That means I will be back on the road tomorrow. Oh. Okay. I have found one of me mates. And I wonder, he's a, bit, he's a bit dodgy this geezer, he's a bit rough, I wonder if he's actually here, I think he is, because his horse is here, this guy's a bit, a bit funny, I am at Haley's Big Baps, oh, outside the windmill, on Elsham Road, <laughs> look at this guy's steering wheel man, it's just like being back in Thailand, look, Look at that. <laughs> oh, look at his glasses. This guy must be a bit, bit cool. With the car park. But check this guy's horse out, right? This guy's got a few horses. I think he's got 12 or 14. But this is the one he's come to work on today. That's a serious two. Yes, she's all right. Yes, she's not. I'm feeling I'm your scooter. I'm back. I'm good. Do you mind being on camera? 
Yo! You don't? I'll turn up round then. Yo, what's going down, people? Oh, good. This is Gary Bowden. Gary in the house. Make some noise. Yo! How many lamp have you got now? I had 14 and down, down to 9. Yes, we sold some. Yes, sold some. I can't ride them all at the same time, but I'll, I'll replace them with things like quality stuff and those. Okay, can I make a vlog about you and your scooters? I can. I can I'll take your lock up. You'll do it. Oh, yeah, with you. Yeah. Tell them a little bit about your history. Yeah, then if you turn up, then if you turn up like, say, after like half one, come with us. I've done a podcast for a week. I'll have to hear the detail. I'll have to prove it's all about the life, about growing up, fighting the police, blah, blah, blah. Fighting the, did you hear that? Fighting the police. That's it, kidnap. And Hayley, you, you're looking good, darling. You've been on holiday? You have? Yeah. Oh, it's good. Yes, I'll, I'll, I'll make that vlog. Yeah, mate. I will. This, this got, yeah, yeah, do you want me to move, move it? No, I did old George. He was Norfolk's most wanted man. <laughs> <laughs> he was. Do you like me parking? <laughs> I got in on the white line. Oh, mate, I hope it ain't me leaking as I am going into Argoise. I am. I am. I'm at the riverside shopping, whatever. And I am. I'm going into Argoise. The book of dreams awaits as it's time. <laughs> this is a moment you've all been waiting for. Not just me. It is time to upgrade to the GoPro 11 and our voice stocks GoPros but where's the book gone? where's the book of dreams? it's no longer a book of dreams it's now a what? price for products now it's a screen of technology appliance toys oh man technology oh cameras <sighs> cameras where is the gopo there action cams we want hero 10 no we don't where is it oh not in stock here okay the hero 11 <laughs> not in can't stock do that in my store what's okay, that you can't film in my store all right, can you turn it off for me, please? I'm filming myself. You're filming my screen. Not so anymore, I'm not. Watch it. Yeah, well, please don't. Okay, you should have a warning there for that, mate. Well, That's... I think it's fairly obvious that it is. No, I actually, I actually think it's a Are we bit. Are on YouTube, sir? Yeah, if you want to come on YouTube, you can. No, I'm I actually mind. think I'm that guy approach with that kind of attitude is outrageous, mate. That's just my opinion. Well, of, of you approaching with that attitude, there's a much day. better way you could have done that, buddy. A much better way. Day. I do, mate. I do. Obviously, you're not. Can you tell me what stall? Right, I, I need to find out what stall that I'm going to have that in. We're finished. Thank you very much. Have a really good day. He is. Thank you. Okay, so you've really represented Argos really well there, mate. And you have represented the general public. Mate, mate, mate. My audience know what I'm like. You've just shown them what you're like. Oh, <laughs> what are people like? Was there any reason for him to come up? I'm just filming the screen to show you guys that there's no book of dreams. There's now a computer screen of stuff that's out of stock. Very poor. Well, you, you, I ain't got to say, you, you, you know I voice my opinion, you can voice your own. Um, and that is the manager there, as he said, uh, that Argoise location, which is situated at the Riverside Shopping um, Centre. Disgraceful actions by that guy. But that is why I keep the camera on. Oh man, it's obviously, that's really weird. It's really weird. I thought he was coming over to help. I can't feel, could anybody please tell me any reason for why that guy acted like that at all? They're very bizarre. Hmm. A strange experience that. And I will never ever. I, I used to actually shop in Argois. First choice. When I heard Argois was a partner that were actually selling GoPro, um, I thought, brilliant, I can go in the shop. You, you see what I did? 
Mate, I will never ever visit an Argois ever again. I was, I, I'm actually quite shocked. Um, wasn't expecting anything like that whatsoever. Um, I really wasn't. <laughs> so I've come home and I have found the exact product that I want right here on Amazon. And it's at 44999, so 450 quid. That, that is the kit I want, the whole bundle. And all I have to do is hit the buy now. It, it, it's brilliant, I've just been on Amazon. I'm still a member from many years ago. And I hit buy now, and then I can pick that up tomorrow. I haven't got to go through any weirdness from any human being acting in a very strange manner and also now now like i say you guys know what i'm like well you know what i'm like i'll bring out the best and the worst and the good and the bad and everything um you also now know what that managing director of that stall is like so i'll, I'll give him an award a desperado which i have come quite fond of you know and so now you guys know what he's like you know what i am like and in the next few minutes of when I turn this off, corporate headquarters are also going to know what the managing director is like. Um, I, I feel the need to send him an email with that clip informing him of, of that, you know. Corporate communication. If I, if I had a manager in a shop, I, I, I'd want to know if, if they were treating the customers like that. So uh, that's, what, that's what I shall do. As they say, there's more than one way to skin a rat. So cheers guys, cheers. Mm. Oh. It's um there's something refreshing and fruity about them. I actually bought them for Woody and I've started drinking them. He's he's not back till later, so he'll probably come back. There might not be any of them left. There may. There may not. Um so that's it that's that little vlog today of what i've been doing i've just got to put the oil in there and tomorrow i should be out on the lambretta and be making vlogs back on the vlogging the dead horse channel which i do need to make a little vlog up tonight because even though i've got my gopro there i have the this is the thing guys i told you before i'll show you on the main vlogging the dead horse channel i made that vlog on sunday to be loaded sunday I made the vlog, did the process, and got it there already. Come on, when you're working. Oh, man. Computer's going a bit glitchy. Non-respondent. I just want to see if the vlog and the dead horse is sorting itself out and getting rid of these addresses. No, it's still there. Add to see the bill. It's been there since... Look, guys, this is what this is all about. That vlog there, I made it Sunday to go up on Sunday, and it's limited, and the ad suitability, look, it's still under review, right? Sometimes it takes a day. This one is now, well, we're on Tuesday, and that's been since I loaded that up. Then, so I'm really sorry. I mean, that should have gone on Sunday. So it's no vlog Sunday, no vlog Monday, and it looks like there's no vlog Tuesday. So as much as I'm trying to get ahead, YouTube is stitching me up. Um, I know I used the word tosser uh, to get round using the word malacca, uh, but like I say, I'm at a car boot. Why it's going through that, I really don't know. Uh, so I'm just going to make a little vlog to put on there tonight to say, look, people, this is what's happening until I actually get out and get about 10 vlogs ahead and allow for those three days. Then uh, I'm disappointed because I want the vlog and the dead horse. It's, it's, look at the views it's getting. I haven't had them views since I chinned someone. Which, <laughs> which, we, uh, you know, oh man, uh, if the manager director of Argos had a pub and was in Patia, we all, we all, we all know how that would have ended, right? Seriously, man, look what happened to that guy. He ended up losing his business. He had to move back to Australia. If, if you ever wondered what happened to, to that guy, he made a complete ass of himself. He lost his business. No one went in there except for young kids with mobile phones pointing it at him saying, is this you, mate, getting knocked out by a YouTuber? Um, he ended up having to give that business up and he now lives back in Australia. Um, so he's like, you've got to be responsible for your actions. And actions now, I mean, that guy there, he's... he's so I must send that off there to corporate communications. Depend how they want to look at it. It's brilliant for a training video. 
uh, if you want to show your staff how not to act to a customer, you don't approach customers with aggression and that, that. you like, you approach them, it's like being a doorman and there's a gate, you don't approach him with aggression, do you? You say, excuse me, utter politeness and mannerisms. Um, I regret to inform you. Not in my, uh, mate, how he acted was absolutely outrageous from a manager's point of view. And, uh, you know. So hang on, what have I got to do on this vlog now? Just go and put the oil in. I put me roast pork in the oven, just roast pork and some parsnips. Not that exciting. So anyway, I'll wrap it up. So anyway, cheers. Cheers to me with a desperado for Woody when he get in. <laughs> and hopefully we'll have a vlog on the Dead Horse channel tomorrow. Hope. So, appreciate you watching, guys. And until the next time I make a vlog, either about me or what I'm up to or, or something oh, that's not Dead Horse related, I'll have a vlog up on this channel. So until then... Au revoir. Oh, excuse me. Au revoir. Oh, excuse me again. Au revoir.